Hello guys, my name is Newton and this is the Wakilisha Christ Show. Uh, it's basically a talk show where we are going to handle a couple of topics with the young people. And in studio today, I have uh, some young guys who are going to introduce themselves and then we are going to roll. So let's start here. Hi guys, I'm Millicent. I'm glad to be here. Uh, my name is Carlton Whitey and I'm a born again Christian and I love the Lord and it's a pleasure to be here. Hello guys, I'm Anjiro Jacqueline. Hello guys, I'm Kivo. Hello guys, my name is Caroline Gena. It's nice to be here. Uh, welcome guys. Now there's a very interesting topic that I want us to handle. Now I'm sure I need to probably may experience who injured. Something to do with peer pressure. So maybe to answer, I need to know from you guys, what do you think peer pressure is? Uh, maybe Mili, what do you think? Peer pressure is uh, for me peer pressure peer pressure is a basic term mainly used in the societies the societies that you're living in or in the generation that you're living in but look at the bigger picture or to look at the deeper meaning of it peer pressure is just basically trying to fit in to something you are not qualifying to you are to qualify for the next time but you are not yet qualified for for now so for me i would try is for me, what I would say is that trying to fit in to a place that you are not qualified in. Yeah. Mm, very interesting. Kevin, do you agree with that? What do you think peer pressure is? Yeah, I'll agree with my sister there. When my definition would be like peer pressure is just moving with the with the move of the crowd without you seeing your like making that firm decision, like you're doing something because the others are doing. That's how I take peer pressure to be. Interesting. Carlton, what are your thoughts? Your pressure ni nini? Ni nini story? First of all, nitasema nita explain pressure ni nini. Kwanza pressure is about all the force. Iki tukiingia kwa masomo, tukiingia physics, pressure is the force that compels or the force applied. Unaona na peer, peer is your friends, our friends, all those people our age mates. Na tukicombine it's a peer pressure. It's a force ama it's a something that tuna huwa ina happen with our peers ili wana to force ama ina tufanya to kwe forced to do something for them ama to ingie in, in a certain situation ili kwa fraisha something it's like that pressure your force ina ku compel ili wafuate something like that. Mm, okay, okay, nice. Uh, so maybe Jackie Talk to us about peer pressure. Una understand peer pressure. Okay, for me, peer pressure is like it is uh, that force that for us young people, but not normally, but for many people say young people, we get into a group, a group of people doing what you want to see. Yeah, I'm doing like them. Okay, okay I'm not talking about your high level. Ah, all right. Uh, maybe to finish up with Carol, peer so, pressure, ni nini kwako? For me, peer pressure is the influence that people of the same age tend to influence each other to do something of this. Ah, now you brought something about very interesting. So does that mean peer was as a way to when as a to as a peer when as you are gonna peer pressure? Do you think they also experience the same kind of pressure? Uh, maybe to endele tu na kwako karo. Yes, our parents can also influence each other, but you know. Our parents work on a, that distinction of knowing what is right and what is wrong. So most pa, most of them tend to follow the positive peer pressure in order to in order for us to emulate them. Ah, good stuff. Now peer pressure. Do you guys think is good? Ama yote inakwagatunimbaya. Is it some animal that we really need to resist? Ama there is a bit of peer pressure ambayo ni poa. Carlton, what do you do? You think? For me, I think that actually peer pressure, there's all uh, there is the negative side and there's the positive side. Meaning that there's a positive peer pressure and there's a negative peer pressure. Ukiangalia in the negative peer pressure, uneza like um ukiangalia drugs and substance vitu kama hizo. Your friends wana ku influence who are for na drugs and substance unaona immorality unaona especially in the sexual parts ndio uki ukiangalia in that perspective unaangalia there's a negative peer pressure and in case ama positive peer pressure kunayo eh uki sana sana mimi ni it's an experience nime happen shule ukiangalia 
miss kwa mtu yani focused bile especially in my form 1 form 2 but there's a friend my peer alikuja kaniambia eh Carlton unafaa kusoma in order to, i may succeed in life it's this is the akanianza kunyonyesha the importance of reading and learning which was a, very impactful so i can say there's a positive peer pressure and there's a negative peer pressure ah uh, kevin nikuje kwako kuna kitu ushaijipata kwa situation yenye mtu ana try ku influence negatively ushai have you ever had such an experience okay i'll uh, take peer pressure is nat- is natural mm-hmm. so everybody who is there outside they are living and uh, is a core subjected to peer pressure i don't know if you've ever seen wazazi wanataka kuishi ma- maisha wazazi wengine wanaishi like you are doing something for your children because the other, another parent is doing the same so peer pressure iko natural so as for me nimejipata kwa state kama hiyo but i'll say because i'm not one person who i'm not very social because maisha yangu ya utotoni imekuwa like siko mse very friendly unacheki siko na marafiki wengi so my social life iko very strong so me i'm that one person who stand with my thoughts nasema this, this is my decision me na stand up na this decision this is what i believe in so me to be to move with the crowd is not very easy but obviously kwa kila mse who unakuanga normal you find your friends and because you don't want to lose them unafanya kinyi wanafanya but ukua ni mse unajina wewe mse anajisikia kwa mind you'll be at that position to say ah na joe ni best yangu but kifika hapa zi i have my own boundaries so i think that is it so mean me pitia but i have to be assertive i have i know my life i know myself better let me come to you caro Uh, how do we get pressured what are some of the ways ambazo you would say we fall into peer pressure okay you can fall into peer pressure when you want to fit in something that you really are not it can be someone who wants to who likes taking drugs but you do not like it but in order for you to get where i am you want to fit in but that does not make sense because I'll, you will not be real but i'll be real me napenda drugs and everything but you you will not be so itakuwa uta trap in into that force ndivyo utake kukua kama mimi but you cannot be uh, how about you mimi ni issues gani unaoanga zinasumbua youths hadi wana fall into peer pressure uh one of the issues ni financial breakthrough or financial lack of finances You know when I lack money and nataka ku kuwa na look fit lazima ni try kuwa ka kepo ama ni try kuwa ka jemo ama maybe ni try kuwa like another person out there mini because nataka kuwa that rich that you know ni kuwa ule mse cool kid lazima nifanye vitu wewe ufanyanga na vitu wewe ufanyanga ni vitu za theft and all that ndio apate venye yeye utaka kuwa yeah Ah uh, Jackie yes. what do you think ni nini hizi zenye zinasumbuaga watu hadi wana fall into peer pressure okay the thing that trouble people a lot is ni ka you you want to be like the other person hiyo kitu ndio who trouble mtu sana because una like akora ukiona tuseme mse akiingia kwa hii group kwa hii rende anataka kuwa na hii kuwa hii you say oh if me me too i want to be like them so najipata tu shaingia that hiyo inakuwa too commonly for young people though but acha nisemwe too rare kwa mapero cause wao wanakuanga wanajua ku distinct ku differentiate between they know the right thing the wrong thing yeah ah uh, one of the most interesting things naona gana most parents unapata anga wakiku advice wanakuambia ga si ukueka so and so wakina nani how do you think hiyo sisi kama the young guys How do we need to take it? Is it something good ama ukianza kuwekwa kwa comparison it makes you feel bad about yourself? Maybe Carlton talk to me about it. For me actually for me I hate comparison actually. Eh <laughs> uh, me me a comparison but unaonanga some parents actually eh uh, mimi nitasema some parents because tumesema it's a peer pressure and they are peers so unaona wako the same league unaona they are the same peers unaona the same age unaona so they feel bad at at some point unaona they like i want you i want you Carlton to become like 
jemu pale nataka ukweka yeye unaona i think i think wana kwanga pressured in us in a kind of way staki kusema ikwe envy lakini unaona i think wana kwanga pressured in a in a kind of way wana kwanga pressured they are like i want you Carlton to become like James because anapita exam unaona ako na EV anaenda church unaona and at that point ukiambia uh, ukitseme jemu aambiwe kuna point anafika i'm like why unaona unajiuliza why unaona because some of the us young people we hate comparison actually we hate comparison because we feel that pressure why does my mom or my dad anataka nikae hivi why does he or she wants me to be like him or her and i take yani mom dad i'm unique in my own way i know yes i will obey you but please <laughs> something like that interesting ah karo maybe ni kuje kwako any time ukisikia mse akikwambia anataka ukuweka so and so i'm sure maybe umewahi kusikia ama somebody venya may behave ni kama ana try kukupush in a certain direction how did it make you feel for it me it lowered my self esteem ju niliona ni kama mimi sifai mimi sifai kuwa vile niko like i have to emulate him in order to to for people to see me so that is why i felt so low ju anataka ni kwa vile anataka si vile mimi niko hiyo ili ni maliza vibaya sana Mm. Uh, maybe another question that I would like to pose to us. Can we or are we in a position to be able to resist peer pressure? Do you think tunaweza resist peer pressure ama inakaa tu inakaa tu kukuja? Kevin, you know, talk to me. Okay, thank you. So, acha nibonge na this level like okay. Peer pressure can venye nilisema nikianza, it's a natural thing ni kitu kwa existing with your will or not and everything that exists mimi najuanga everything that is a problem has a solution na i world kunanga venya ati kuna staff zenye zina solution every question of life has its own solution so ni mimi nitasema pia pressure iko na solution yake and maybe to say me you know if i know my life if i know me if i understand me better I get to be in a position of knowing what I want in life, what I don't want, what people want in me and what I want about myself. So if I know those those four things, I'll be at a position to do to say like Mr. Fanya is staff kwa joto anafanya or I'll do this even if nobody is doing it. You know, ukifanya vitu uh, expecting people to appreciate you, it's very rare. Do you know people only appreciate your success but they will not appreciate the process? And I always say that when you own a car your life that 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 travel that journey that you're moving you know you are going unapata kuna wa mabishi wanataka hivi it's a process wewe kufika who you are or who you want to be it's a process and along the process you have to know what you want so me na stand na as peer pressure have a solution has a solution unaweza choose to stand on your ground say me east staff fanya ama say me east staff nafanya at least influence other people to do what you are doing don't be always be carried away by what people are doing na isa sema mimi nitasimama na simamo yangu and because of my farm foundation unapata kuna wasenda influence wasema wanasema eh wao mse anakuwa na msimamo wao mse anajua kwenye anaenda but wao kikwa kila mse unaenda tu you know a tree a tree moves by the direction of the wind hiyo kitu hata no matter how strong the roots are inakuwa tu hivi ikipelekwa hivi when it is it is so strong the wind is so strong una prime vujika those are people who are like what to call wana if rest on peer pressure they move at any direction but they can choose to stand firm waseme enyewe skatai nyine mabishte but at least you have to appreciate who i am i don't have to do things because you're doing if you want to do do it but don't force me to do it so it's a solution yeah fantastic mili Ukiangalia zile trends ziko currently uh, kuna trends za kuvaa maybe trends za kwenda this uh, funky places how in yourself unaweza ngaje ku resist kutoka hii pia pressure one thing nasikianga roho inakulanga biscuit so no way 
no way at naweza takula hiyo stuff ni enjoy na mimi mwenyewe sitaki unajua siwezi kula kitu nakula at you like ndio tufanane hapana i have my own rules i have my own principles and the worst thing that inatusumbua sisi young generation tuko na principles yes but the problem is following those principles tuna make principles enya tufuati mbona unazi make basi you like you know mimi kama mili niko na principles za kwangu you know i don't do this i don't do this then why i anti following them because the moment unaniambia you are not following them and yet nikikwambia hivyo utafuata you get make principles that you are able to follow yeah ah very nice jack nikuje kwako how are you able to resist from ile peer pressure and your peers the young guys mabishti zako maybe wakikuja wakwambie when the clubbing ama that kind of a thing how are you able to resist okay for me first and foremost acha tu ni kwe realistic true inakuwa tu kwa wazazi sema oh mama taniliza oh siji inakuwa anga by the way percentage ya cut off peer pressure sema hiyo hiyo staff ya kwenda bash so tuseme ukiana idha time hapana mzazi ajitikia so at least hii inaweza cut off yeah uh, you you see any time say akikuja na a, a way of life that they wish to impose on you you always have a choice to say no na the biggest thing ambayo yenye uko nayo as a as a person is the ability to say no the world that we live in iko na watu wengi sana ambao ni they are just yes people so ukiona indio kitu yenye ina trend everybody jumps on the ship na sometimes unaruka kwa ship yenye possibly we mwenye hau understand nini na happen only later you come to realize that umekuukienda the wrong way so guys there is a chance there is a, a, a for us to actually say no to some of these things however like we started by saying peer pressure si ati ni it's not always bad for instance kuna times unaweza pata msia amekuja amekwambia tuingie gym and from hapo una get to learn kumbe unaweza exercise and you can be a better person than you are but most of the times ile peer pressure yenye kwa industry or rather in the world that we are living in people are always trying to pull you kwa vitu zenye ziko ziko wrong na vitu zenye haziko zinakatana na like she said your principles but when you have a, a principle rather and uh, you are able to stand then is we to zote hazita ikusukuma tu akona na my last question is can we eliminate peer pressure do you think tunaweza eliminate ama it's here with us to stay na tujipange tuishi nayo ah uh, karo talk to me <laughs> eliminating will be will be according to your choices mm-hmm. if you make your choice useme no peer pressure haitanibeba The, that is the negative peer pressure haitanibeba mm. it will not ju ukiamua you stand by your words and nothing can come against your words so you have to choose where to follow what will lead you to a better future yeah uh, how about you Carlton unaona aje tunaweza na ama hii kitu imetulemea first of all i will second what karo has said minta ina add kwa word because it's one come on again nitaenda kwa word word ya god ametuambia in deuteronomy ametuambia that i've given you free will to choose whatever you want unaona ju tumesema peer pressure it's about all yani as peers tunakuwa yani tuna influenceiwa with the other peers tunakuanga yani na hiyo pressure ya ku want, uh, want to fit in in a, in a certain group i want to fit in in a certain as kind of friends unataka ku fit in lakini word ya god ametuambia that i've given you free will to choose whatever you want so in whatever you do in this peer pressure i'll second what karo amesema that you must choose what you want tumeongea about principles unafaa kuwa na principles zako and what you follow and me me na the second and same principles zetu zinafaa kuwa za god ju ukiangalia life ya daniel ukiangalia okay, life ya na friends wake Shadrach Meshach na Abednego walikuwa at a, at a point that they were pressured to bow down unto an idol 
si ndio they were uh, yani wamepushiwa into a corner by the king unaona hiyo mi nazasema it was a pressure because ukiangalia kila mtu everyone when the trumpets blew and everything blew uh, and every musical instruments blew kila mtu ali bow down you see kila mtu aka bow down if we, kama wewe ni mtu umesema to you, you have your principles i know what i, I want i know what uh, i believe in unaona you want to bow unto that pressure unaona uta stand out na useme no unaona vinye tu ili blow up the instruments zilichezwa shadrach meshach na bendog abenegom walisimama wakasema we won't bow unto this idol hata kama everyone will bow we do not care what people will say unto our life because sana sana as, as as young people and other people what we care about what other people will say unto our lives unaona wana unajiuliza what will they say what unapigana na hiyo mawazo unajiuliza what will they say unto my life what will they comment unajua what will they yani watatungo watatufanya nini watanifanyia nini kama i want to join them unaona unakuwa in that a moment of pressure but mungu ametuambia i didn't call you many but i call you as one unaona you are called as one unaona in amongst even the peer pressure i still called you as one amen fantastic so guys we've come to the end of our uh, talk show today but before these guys leave nataka tu kila mmoja yenu anipatie a parting shot uh, regarding this uh, stuff about peer pressure anything that you would like the viewer and an eye home tukianzia hapa kwa code uh for me naweza sema you know we are young people na tunaangalia anga the young people tunda vya tunaweza ka But me for me neza neza waambia do not let people look down on you because you are young but set an example for the believers and for the young people in faith in conduct in purity and in balance yeah and also that thing of trying to fit in peer pressure trying to fit into something you know hiyo ni kama unaona jacket ya mtoto wa class 1 and unaangalia age yangu the 20 the 20 ages eh like na jibu ku 15 in that jacket but siwezi wacha na jacket ya mtoto live alone in the world live your life ishi maisha yako pia wadi nasema nga do not conform to the pattern of this world but be conformed by the transformation of your mind enda na wazo ya god enda tuna vya god na ku direct pray for the direction and also seek for the pap- seek for you to know your purpose in this life because if the purpose of something is not known it is usually exposed to abuse and also we pray god to help us unlock the potential that we have because us as young people to kona potentials mingi sana ndi venya tujaza kuzi realize let us realize our potentials so that we can work on them yeah thank you carlton thank you Newton. so for me i'll tell you that to me about kona positive peer pressure negative itaenda kwa positive remember in all the pressures kuna kwanga in a positive side unaona we have the positive things that we can do we, as as young people tunaweza invite other people unaona your friends your family into the church that's a positive peer pressure unaona and everything that you do always be assertive in everything that you do when your yes is yes stick with it when your no is no stick with it because Many are called but few are chosen that's the word of god remember that you are chosen as one be real kwa real stay stand out as young as we are stand out thank you oh, Jackie. okay for me what i told the viewers is kama vinya to define pressure in form one that it is a push or a pull where uki push you are into it just pull out then when yet tunasema tu kiambia here with the necessity to carry that pressure peer pressure unaweza eliminate kwangu yes unaweza eliminate but for me tutaishi nayo tu but you are the one to choose utakaa in a positive and in the negative and i will urge you that always pull people in a positive pressure yeah kevin your parting shots thank you for that so Let me ask all of you if you want to buy a phone costing 
and uh, surely you are in need of this phone au na phone ingine and you just need this 50000 na kama ifiki 50000 you feel like uh, you're not having a phone so how much will you sell yourself priceless how much carlton or juza how much Priceless. So what I'm just trying to say is that don't allow any situation or any uh, any circumstance in your life to change your value because we have to understand our value. We have to know how the worth, the quality that we carry. I I get to understand that God did not create us just to exist just to be moved around by every wave that comes around or just to associate with these people you have a value and everybody always pata saya 300 iko imeko pamoja na kasaya 50 because different watches have different values and watch different value na watu different utapata kuna huo msi rich atavaa saya kutoka 20k kuna huo msi tuko huko chini tutaona eh 20k na niko shule eh hiyo hiyo value iko so high for me i'll just buy ya so mbili ya so tatu and then you'll be very proud utaona indo inanifit at this level so as we go to level to different levels we we gain different values and as we go to different level we 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 leave different people tunachanga tu watu huko chini because as you go up some people will not go up with you so utawa, utapata that you are leaving them behind uh, most of us tunakuanga that uh, time that we want to 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 have a crowd of people with us we want to be popular we want to be those people that ukitokea preso na your name is mentioned e kevo 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 obviously kevo na bro tuko very tuko very familiar with people but uh, unacheki you want to carry that that popularity unacheki so because of that tunapata wa say they will just involve in different things wanataka like your value cannot be measured with drugs your value cannot be measured with how much wealth you have there's a time i was talking with my friend and kawambia uh, the background of your 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 parent is the decision they made the background the how poor or how rich you are is the decision of your parent but how poor or how rich you be will be your own responsibility so me cannot lose my value only because i want to hold a crowd of people I, I have my values. I, I, I need to, uh, to surround myself with people who see the value in me. So if you, you don't see how precious and how priceless I am, then you don't get to be around me. Let's work with our own values. Tuache kwa nse tunafanya kitu one because other people are doing. Let's stand with our value. Like I cannot waste my life because I'm precious. I cannot just use my life anyhow because I'm precious. We have a value. Una cheki. So me I'll tell to just the young people outside there. Let us have a value. Let's stand up for our value. We have a quality. We cannot just be used to anyhow. And if you forget about your identity, you forget about your purpose, you can be used just for any other purpose. So tukaina purpose yetu, tukaina value yetu, and then we accept ourselves. Because wase wengi huko sa kuji accept ndo huko wanaenda tu na kirindi. Akisema tunen tu hivi wanaenda. They just like a tree tossed every direction by the wind. So we be stand in our value and then to kwe farm and then to say if anything does not uh, add any value in my life, I don't get to have it. Yeah. Fantastic. Carol, your final thoughts. So for me as young people, let us learn to say yes or no. Let us stand out and let us choose the right people to be with. Let the let the people we choose make a difference in our lives and better our future. And let us stand out. Always stand out so that others may emulate you and may want you to be their role model. Thanks again viewers for joining us. Indeed it has been a very edifying chat with these young people getting to understand what peer pressure is all about. And I know that it, it has helped you in one way or the other. Make sure you spread the word for guys to watch. And until next time, see you and keep it locked. God bless.